Hi. Hello. My name is uh, Eldrin, uh, Eldrin Carrillo. And it's, uh, today I'm going to be making a video for all in the kitchen. And today we're going to be making one special dish from the north side to Mexico. From Monterrey, Torreon. It's uh, uh, New Laredo. Uh, Nuevo Laredo. This is the place. It's, uh, they like to make the chicken. That they call them chicken rape. Chicken rape this is very tasty. And today we're gonna be making we're gonna be show you how to make it make it. It's uh, uh today what is required, it's gonna be required of course. Is uh one of these is, uh ingredients we require is uh, of course the chicken, you're gonna be required uh mustache, you're gonna be required Chile ancho in chile guajillo like this yeah chile guajillo is uh we're gonna be required the granular chicken of course this is gonna be required the apple cider vinegar you're gonna be required one can of beer is uh and uh, we're gonna be required as well this is um uh, potatoes what kind of potatoes is potatoes uh, this time we're gonna be get this one because it's big ones but you're gonna be watching again and then you're gonna be peeled uh, in Mexico we have the more small ones so, so we we in in Torreon we they don't peel them they put this the only watch and they throw the way to uh, to the oven but today is uh, we're gonna be peeled it's a uh, of course it's gonna be required as well uh, uh, garlic is going to be required uh, is special herbs like the romero you're going to be required uh, thymey you're going to be required as well is uh, uh, ginger is uh, and of course it's going to be made with the, all this is going we're going to be putting the in the skin of the the chicken for that reason, is this, uh, you're going to be start with this. And, and then it's, it's going to be prepared two different ways. One, you're going to be using this kind of potatoes. And as well, you're going to be, because some people is like it with a mashed potato. Well, you're going to be giving you two choice. This one and mashed potato. I'm going to be showing you how can we make it. It's easy. It's not a big deal. And of course, this one is gonna be make it very good taste. Okay, it's um, uh, because it's it's a juice lemon concentrate, the garlic. You know, you see, you're gonna be use it, and of course, you're gonna use the green sauce, salsa verde. But it's uh, uh, we're gonna be change little bit the flavor for make it more better about uh like this is uh because it's good one but it gonna, can be better so now uh, today you're going to be making better that of course you're going to use a one bottle empty bottle for spread the uh, when it's inside to the oven the chicken yeah we you're going to be spread this one with a uh, with a uh, vinegar with a uh, beer with a uh, 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 little species outside, but this uh, as well the the can of the the beer you're gonna be put in the middle of this chicken, so it's gonna be start to be work with that. Okay, now we can put uh, two two chiles the uh, arbor, uh, one chile. Uh, uh no, no two chiles a uh, guajillo and and one um, one chile ancho is uh, for start to cooking a little bit not too much because it's gonna make it bitter and when it had to be soft we had to be blender okay so now you just put a little little uh, heat uh, with a uh, with a uh, with the chilies is uh, in the meantime yeah this is uh, now you're gonna use the 
one uh, no, no, one more symbol this small, small one ah yes okay one this one this. we're gonna be put yeah is we put a little olive oil this is for cooking okay when he says ready you're gonna be put a little water and then you're gonna be put the blender okay uh, after we already heat already heat the water you see the colors of the chilies is already changed a little more orange so it means it's already what is the next the next is blender we need to be blended but what was it going to be do we're going to be put the, the chili with the water plus you're going to be put uh, the uh, extra ingredients so this is going to be start to this i'm going to be show you mm -hmm. okay now you can see everything we want to be put and we'll start to with the, the water Okay, done. Uh, is uh, we're gonna be put a uh, garlic, one spoon or the two garlics. Okay, this is one big spoon. Okay, we're gonna be put as well a little salt. Oh, oops. Well, uh, more or less, it's a one spoon. Okay. You're gonna be put as well. It's a little uh, uh, mustard dijon. A little bit, well, one spoon. Okay. Okay. And is a uh, uh, what is uh, the this is spoon salt and uh, what is the the pepper? Oh, the pepper is hiding. It's hiding, hiding. It's hiding the pepper. And then you're gonna be start to blender. Now is the presentation of the of the sauce is gonna be used for the chicken. This is I show you this one. Is let you see how they look like. This is uh, the color is uh, and of course it's gonna be start to be additional to, uh, in the container, and then you're gonna be put is. Uh, the rest of the the ingredients okay okay after we put the filter and we're going to be keep it only the sauce the the seeds everything you have to not blend there properly you're going to be keep it for through the put in the bin because this one is not required anymore only the the, the sauce the pure sauce for the reason this one is going to be through the way the bin. After we have the species over here, we have the the, the sauce with the uh, mixed herbs. We have as well the, the thyme. We have as well the uh, uh, garlic. We have as well in pander is mean, uh, and as well we have a. Uh, uh, what is this? Uh, ah, lemon. You have as well this uh, little uh, uh, romero. In in that one is, is is mixing with the rest of the sauce. You see that one? This is we can be mixing with the rest of the sauce. This is already. Yeah. So this one. 
is going to be put in the chicken. Now we're going to be open the chicken. The chicken is, as uh, you see, the chicken um, uh, extra large. So this means it's supposed to be this, this big one. So it's, uh, this chicken, you have to be put in the Okay, okay, this, okay, this one, hmm. this is going to be take off from this, because we don't require this one at the moment. And what you going to do with the chicken? First, we need to cut in little uh, skin. This skin, we need to be cutting, because it's, um, need to be clean properly. I mean not too much because this this chicken is just already clean. So you're gonna be take out this one and put it in the bin. We don't need to. So this grease we don't need to. So okay. So it's gonna be take out this one. And of course it's uh Okay, and then as well on top, I'm gonna be doing the same. Is uh, gonna be take off this one and this one. And that's it. It's very simple. No need too much. Okay. After this, we need to be the open the skin and try to be. We carefully not cutting, not cutting uh, the meat. Only is uh, try to be not cutting the. Um, uh, oh, this one it had a lot of uh, crumbs over here. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. When you find that this one, it can be had to be take off because it's not really good one. You had this one. Okay. This one is just almost almost done. Okay, so it's uh it's very important to be cutting. Uh, me not cutting the skin because we need the skin. But this uh we need to uh, uh, separate from the meat because it's gonna be start to put uh, the meat uh, in the meat in the metal the, the between the 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 skin and the, and the meat you're gonna be put the, the the sauce for that reason it's very very important to be try to be clean separate this one carefully not cutting the skin okay only separate okay because it's very very important to that if you see some plums or something is not proper for the skin take off like this you have to be clean 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 it's very important to that okay okay hmm. okay this is for this way now it's just going to be start to from this way you're going to be do the same Okay, this is mm -hmm. okay. It's very very important to that. Mm. It's a separate the skin. The skin is not have to be uh, stay together with the meat. We we need to separate. For that reason, we do like this. Okay. This one is very, very important to that. Mm. Okay, this is a um, try to be clean properly. It's uh, try to be not cutting the, the skin. Okay, when well, you have to like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, we're gonna be cutting carefully with uh, no cutting the meat because we want to the meat, of course. Okay, this is in the fingers have to be coming inside to that. This, um, and now we're gonna be put the uh, Try to be separate properly the the skin. Mm. Mm -hmm. Try to be separate, separate, and then it's uh, gonna be put when it's separate, like coming all the meat, okay. Okay, now we have a, already have a, the, oh, we're going to move this piece. We have the, the, the can of the beer. We open, it's enough, we open, and this one, you're going to be put, um, the, all the oregano we have, is, uh, we, literally we have to be put one spoon oregano. So, we're going to be making the new ones, it's, uh, Okay. Oregano, where is it? Oregano, oregano, oregano. Is uh, oregano. Is a. Uh, is this a uh, garlic? Yeah. You're gonna be put a uh, uh, mix of hearts. It means timing. Uh, it's uh, romero. It's in uh, in oregano. You're gonna be put the one one spoon. Yeah, and then more important. The the mixing over here we already have a mixing. Yeah, very nice over here. And then what is the next? Ah, you need to put this one in the chicken. Yeah, and then you're gonna be open the the. The space of the, the chicken, the metal, this is going to be put in the metal like this. Try to be put uh, all can be inside. Usually, the the can is had to be 350 millimeters. But now, it's uh, because it's, uh, today, is the, the can is big ones. For no reason. Big one, yeah, it's just like this, okay? It's very important to that. And then, is uh, after this, we're gonna be put uh, all this off, all this, and put in the chicken, okay? Carefully, don't drop it because if you drop it, you drop it the beer. So this is very carefully. Mm -hmm. Potatoes, potatoes, and all the potatoes. Because this one is very small one, so these ones you're gonna be put around. After wash, of course, we're gonna be washer, washer, all the the potatoes. 
Okay. Okay, this part of the potatoes gonna be put over there. Wash, 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 wash properly. Try to be put on the round to the chicken. You're gonna be put like this, okay? Uh, you're gonna be put the after wash. Yes, I'm gonna be show you. This is the chicken, and uh, all the. Uh, all the potatoes around, so you're gonna be put as well. Yes. Okay. <coughs> okay, we want to be put as well this one. This is uh, is no, want to be checking is no no missing. Ah, it's missing one. Okay. Okay, where is potatoes? And then you're gonna be put uh, as well sauce everywhere. This is see us like this. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna be put a little one. I'm gonna be put a little more soft uh, potatoes. I'm gonna be put a little more. Hmm. Yeah, a little more potatoes. Yes, this one is a little different, but it's okay. It's uh, big ones. Mm -hmm. Just like this. Just like this. Gonna be put a little more. Yes, the last potatoes. It's already put uh, the oven to pre cook, pre heat. So this is uh, very important to try to be put the uh, uh, chicken over there and in, in the metal. This is put the potatoes. Okay. And that's it. Now what is the next? Let's continue with this spread to all the sauce. The rest of the sauce, because you're going to be put on top to the potatoes. <laughs> oh, little, whoa, what happened here? Now dream. 
Trying to be not throw away the, the chicken. Ooh, this is that's the problem. We have to be take care. Of this one. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. Because if you spread the, you drop the chicken, drop the beer, and we need the beer. So that reason, what had to be do that right now? Okay, with this, yes. Try to be put properly. Try to be put properly. Or not drop it the chicken. It's very important to not drop it. If you drop it, you need to take up checking how is what is the, the beer to drop it and refill it. You need to refill it. Because it's very important to be is uh, have the level of the chicken. We have it here. Yeah. Okay. Now we have a level. It's not dropping too much. Okay. Now it's just like this. This is the raping again. The chicken in the oven. And now it's ready for put in the oven. And be careful not wrap it like this because okay, it's very very important to that. Okay, now it's ready. It's, uh, we're gonna be clean a little bit because okay, and then it's gonna be put. Okay, and that's it. This one is going to be put one and a half hour in the in the oven. Okay, it's very very important that. This is now the chicken is is uh, ready. I want to be show you for different angle. Is uh, this is the chicken and the ribs. Okay, and what is the next? Put in the oven, and it's going to be when it's ready. It's uh, gonna be show you how they look like. Hello, hi. It's, uh, now this is uh, the chicken is ready. So basically, it's uh, it, it's gonna be yes, it start to to get out the uh, the chicken. With the carefully, is, the paper is gone. Just, you have to be leaving the paper to the, the chicken. Okay? It's very, very carefully to be trying to be take off. It's not burn it. Yes. It's time. Okay. So now the chicken is ready. Yes. Chicken is ready like this. You see that? It's uh, you're gonna be taken carefully, not uh, now. It's uh, you're gonna be taken with the uh, with the tongue, and we're gonna be pick up the, the chicken. The chicken is also already cooked. It's not cooked, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So, chicken ready. See? So, okay. You see, all the, the chicken is done. So, basically, carefully. And try to be not drop it because it's so cooked. The chicken, you see that? So we put here. The chicken is almost look. All the pieces of the chicken is gonna be 
done. For that reason, they, they are very, very easy to be picked up. So, look at look at this. It's beautiful. So now we want to be put the potatoes in the round. This wanna be carefully close the oven. Okay. I show you how uh, this one this is already done. Potatoes is ready cooked, but well done, very very well done. Okay, you see that? Okay, and now you can see the chicken is ready. This is a uh, show you. This, this one is already done. So basically, if you want to the, make the, this kind of chicken, you see the the chicken. You see, this is is so so cooked because, of course, uh, this is the uh, the chest, the breast. The breast is dry, but the reason we use the with the with a uh, spoon and we're gonna be spread juice around to the 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 chicken breast only the chicken breast because you know the chicken breast is easy to be dry for that reason have to be carefully this one you see all the meat is easy to be dry okay. Okay, you see this one, this is a chicken, it's very, very cooked, this is a very, very good one. So this one is going to be enjoyed very, very well. And of course, if you like it, if you like it, this kind of videos, is uh, please give me a like, it. it's a uh, subscription, and of course, it's a... Uh, uh, make it a comment if you make it this is a how the it taste this one is taking one and a half hour it's uh between 160 degrees in, in one and a half hour and th this one is very very well done it's uh and of course if, if you uh, you're gonna be very tasty and of course you're gonna be enjoy the, this kind of dish it's uh uh you the the service is uh myself is Eldon Carrillo is glad to be see you is uh and we will see you in the next video with a new uh, dish of the Mexican food is uh very well thank you very much and see you the next time hasta la vista